Numbers continue to improve here in Illinois. Health officials reporting more than 3,300 new improbable cases in the last day. Another 50 people have lost their lives to the coronavirus, including a Cook County man in his 30s and a Kane County woman in her 40s. The average case positivity rate fell below 6%. Now an update on where all of our state's regions stand when it comes to the COVID-19 restrictions. Regions 1 and 2 and 6, which cover much of North Central, Central and Eastern Illinois, have entered Tier 1. That means restaurants can be open at 25%. Casinos and hotels are open and gatherings are limited to 25 people. Regions 8, 9, 10 and 11, which includes most of the Chicago area, are at Tier 2. Bars and restaurants are not allowed to have indoor service and gatherings are limited to 10 people. Regions 4 and 7, which include Will and Kankakee counties, as well as suburban St. Louis, are at Tier 3. Under that level, indoor service at restaurants also suspended, indoor fitness classes paused, and remote work is encouraged. Regions 3 and 5 in Western and Southern Illinois are in phase four, which means gatherings are 50 or fewer. Schools and childcare can open, and restaurants and theaters can open with capacity limits. With Region 2 relaxing restrictions, indoor dining is back on the table in Kendall County. Yeah, but in one area, restaurants right across the street from one another are under different restrictions. And WGN's Brona Tumulty is in Montgomery, a village that spans multiple counties and regions. Brona? Good evening, guys. Yeah, we reached out to several restaurants around here because Montgomery is kind of in a weird spot, quite literally. Part of it lies in Kendall County and the rest is in Keen County, which is really not a big deal at all, except when it comes to COVID. Those county lines mean they're in two separate regions. Kendall is part of Region 2 and Keen is part of Region 8. So Region 2 going forward will now be allowed to resume indoor service at 25% capacity or 25 people, whichever is less. Reservations are also limited to a couple of hours. Groups can't be bigger than four people and it's recommended your fellow diners all be members of your household. But in speaking with some of the people here in town, it seems indoor dining really hasn't gone away at all for many restaurants in both Keane and Kendall counties. Many were told have continued it in spite of the state rules. The sheriffs came in and said that they were fine with as long as everybody was and everything's appropriately distanced in the dining room and in here. There was no type of warnings or citations or anything given to him. Now, we did reach out to the Sheriff's Department to see if any citations had actually been issued to any restaurants around here. I wasn't able to get hold of the right people, which I'm told is due to it being a holiday. We're live in Montgomery, Bruno Tumulty, WGN News.